Hello, I'm Richard from Tyne Valley Aquatics and today I'm going to show you how to make a moving bed filter for your aquarium. We've used this filter in many of our tanks and we find it particularly good in shrimp tanks. Uh, shrimps being, of course, very susceptible to ammonia. It just cuts out the ammonia spikes you get after feeding or after restocking. It's also very good for discus tanks. Again, discus don't like ammonia, don't like pollutants in the water. This keeps them down to zero. At present, there's no manufacturer making a moving bed filter for tanks. So here's your opportunity to make your own. First thing you're going to need is a bottle. Any bottle. doesn't really matter what sort of shape or size it is, as long as it fits in your tank. Uh, it does help if it's got a flat back, that gives you more room for putting your suckers on, but uh, you can use round ones, not a problem. First stage is to drill four holes. I've drilled one, two, three, four. If you drill them just slightly less than the diameter of the back of your sucker, you'll find that it'll be a hard push to get it in, but it'll go in and it'll stay in which will give it stability when it's in your tank. Next stage is to drill some holes along the front of your bottle. I've put six in here, approximately four or five mil, about a quarter of an inch in diameter. That will allow the air to escape, which is pretty important. The next step is to fill your bottle approximately a quarter full with the media. Then you take your cap, you drill a hole just big enough to get the airline through, you feed the airline through, put your air stone on, and screw on the top. So now when you attach this to your air pump, air is going to bubble up in here and be expelled through the top. You'll find that the media won't move very fluently at first, It'll take a few days, even a few weeks, until the, the layer of bacteria gets built up on the surfaces to enable it to move quicker through the water. I almost forgot, before you stick this in your tank and set it away, you need to drill loads of little holes, you know, eight to ten little holes, around the neck of the bottle. Make the holes one or two mil diameter, and that'll allow water from your tank to be drawn in and expelled out the top. It'll also help with the cycling of the media as well. After a few weeks, you'll notice that the media becomes brown or even black in colour. That's a good hardy layer of bacteria building up on the media. Um, you'll also find that it'll move a lot more fluently with time. As it moves more fluently, you could also add a bit more media and then more and more and more until you get a real soup going in there. The more media, the more bacteria, the more bacteria, the less ammonia and nitrite you're going to have in your tank. The media used in this filter has been used in, for many years in water processing plants, uh, fish farms, you know, where after heavy feeding, the ammonia spikes. This takes the ammonia out straight away because of the eager bacteria that's living on it. So what's so special about this filter? Well, the bacteria that colonizes this particular media is a very hardy bacteria, which means it's an eager feeder. It feeds very rapidly on ammonia. So as soon as you get ammonia in your tank, this bacteria is eating it away, converting it to nitrite, then converting it to nitrate. Um, a way to make this even more efficient is if you attach this to the uplift of your under gravel filter, your under gravel filter will act as a mechanical filter and also a slight biological filter. Uh, the outlet of your under gravel filter will bubble up through here and this will act as the main biological side of the filter. Because of the chaotic motion of the media, the bacteria is constantly getting knocked off and recolonized, knocked off, recolonized. So only 
the very strongest bacteria survive on here. If you go to our website www.tynevalleyaquatics.co.uk there's a place on there where you can order the parts necessary to make your own filter. Also on our website is a downloadable fish list which has a full stock list and also a price list of all the fish that we stock, uh, all of which are available for nationwide delivery. Where there's a dream, there's a way it seems You can be there if you want Before too long